we are taking frequency fields, vibrational fields, and we are turning them into this apparently uh, solid, but not so, holographic, illusory reality, which only exists not only on our screen, but only exists in a series of micro frequencies that we call visible light. Because, you know, as I was saying in that clip uh, from Brixton, um, people think they see with their eyes, but they don't. They, the eyes are part of the decoding process, but it's the brain that constructs reality. Mm. This is why a, um, a hypnotist can intervene in the decoding process by implanting the belief, the beliefs, a belief is a program, it makes the brain decode reality in accordance with the belief. This is why religious beliefs, political beliefs, scientific beliefs, all these uh, cultural beliefs are so powerful in um, imprisoning people in this false reality and these um, uh, belief systems, these prison cells. And what a hypnotist is doing is implanting a, a programmed uh, belief which then decodes reality to fit. So, someone's eating a uh, potato. I've seen this happen. And they're eating a potato. The implanted belief by the hypnotist is that they're he eating a, an mm. apple. So what do they taste? They taste an taste apple, apple yeah. because the brain's decoding system has been programmed to read that and not what it's really being sent. Now, you take that over the, the wider scale of society you take it on board that behind uh, the, the politicians and the banking system and the uh, transnational corporations and the, all these people, the military and the media uh, at ownership level, are a um, network of interbreeding families that go back to the ancient world. And they understand, at least the core of them do, that we are uh, living in this illusory matrix uh, decoded reality. And the mass of the people are told from cradle to grave that this is all real, this is all solid, and, and there is an out there world which actually only exists in here. We think it's out there, it's an, 